This video is brought to you by our amazing supporters over at Patreon. Hey everyone, it's Ben from board to bits In this video, we're kicking off a new series about procedural generation. Specifically, we'll be implementing a building generator. Procedural generation is a massive topic, and any tutorial is going to cover a small slice of the subject. But I'm going to try and break this series down into parts that let us cover some core concepts around generation, beyond just the step-by-step -step of building the generator. Each part may be one or two videos, and the parts will build on each other. In the first part, we'll talk about the design of our generator, some vocabulary around procedural generation, and a way to formally define our buildings. This will give us an outline when we start writing our code. Next, we'll implement a default generator, as well as a rendering object, so that we can see our buildings beyond the data around them. We'll be using Kenny's Medieval Building Asset Pack, which you might recognize from the Camera Control series earlier this year. But the intent is that you can adapt the renderer to use whatever assets you need. In the next part, we'll start creating some unique rules for the building generation. This will give us the ability to establish new sets of rules if we want to craft different types of buildings, and to make more fine-grained edits to our rules more easily. We'll implement these custom rules using the strategy design pattern with scriptable objects. Lastly, we'll cover some higher level features and ways to make our generator more extensible, and we'll look at how the fundamentals we use in our building generator can expand to procedurally generating other things. This is an exciting topic and one with a lot of uses in game design and development, and I'm looking forward to diving into the subject in the next video. In the meantime, you can subscribe to the channel and get alerts when new videos release, and consider backing on Patreon, where you can get project files and early updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.